What you're about to experience are my opinions and truths. I'm suggesting their possibilities for you to consider, in which you can then come up with your own logical conclusions. And hello everyone, welcome once again. My name is Logan, and this is Deco Jew Reality. Today I'm doing one on the impeachment of Donald John Trump on this day, December 18th, 2019. It's a very special presentation. I got about nine slides, folks, so stick with me, but I'm going to show you with supporting evidence exactly why this impeachment happened and who's behind it. So here we go. As you know, my methods of decoding, I use numerology, the spoken word, the spells that we speak. That's why they say, how do you spell your name? What's the spelling of your name? Yeah, I'll give you numbers. Those numbers can be transferred into the alchemy aspect, science. And we can start to measure the spoken word using these elements of the periodic table. And then, of course, to get a picture, because we think in pictures, we can use the tarot and get a little bit of a visual. I also use the string of pi often in my decodings and of course last but not least common sense so here we go folks i thought this was rather interesting decoding this i just opened it up and started decoding and went down the hole and just had to start creating slides and, and lo and behold look at this using the english ordinal the word impeachment equals the number 107 the big standout besides the 107 it's 11 letters which of course is the number of magic, alternating current. When you observe letters as symbols, you know, these two side by side, I mean, that's energy going up and down. I mean, it's an electromagnetic frequency. But anyway, impeachment 0107 in the English ordinal, that's important because it's tied to the element silver. And why is silver important? Because it's the 47th element on the periodic table, which is massive because it's tied to what I believe that runs this matrix reality and your government in Washington, DC. Runs it, runs the show, pulling the strings behind the scenes, Tetragrammaton. And there is the four letter word of the Hebrew Israelite God, ancient Hebrew. And there's uh, some significance tied to the planet Saturn and Jupiter in that instance as well. Let's keep going. This is when the date that it happened, of course, today, December 18th, 2019, decoding that through the Chaldean equals 51. Why is 51 important? Because it's the all-seeing eyes element. It's antimony. They used to rub this under their eyes in ancient Egypt. It's the eye of Horus. And this is directly taken off the Royal Society of Chemistry. And antimony is the 51st element. That's the date it's tied into. The all-seeing eye, and of course, there it is on the dollar bill. On the US dollar bill. Now, when we break it down even further, we want to get the measurements of the weight of antimony. This is the most abundant weight of antimony, I might add. There are several, but this is the most abundant. It measures at 120.904. And then when we measure that using numerology, 120904, we get the number 322. I wonder if these guys had anything to do or any kind of influence on the impeachment. I do know that these guys are tied to the all seeing eye. And that's where you get this on a dollar bill and the whole nine yards. And of course, these guys are out of Yale. Notice the Y, as in the Yod. It's very interesting. Now, when we go through and we put in the full numerology, December 18th, 2019, impeachment. That's a statement. We get the number 183 in the English ordinal. 183, of course, is huge because it's tied to the element tungsten. The 74th element, because its weight is 183. And I thought this was interesting. I'm watching CNN tonight. One of the rare moments that I was watching it to get a kick out of it, to watch the show, eat my popcorn. And they had this on Kumo's show. 
saying that the GOP compares the Trump impeachment to Jesus' crucifixion, Pearl Harbor, and Salem witch trials. Now, why would they say something like that? Well, it's obvious. See, you see, that's why man cannot be doing this alone. It's impossible. It's not possible. And, you know, 74 is tied to the word Jesus in the English ordinal. And, of course, when was Jesus crucified? At age 33. And that's the element arsenic, the 33rd element. And its weight is 74 which is tied to Jesus, which is tied to tungsten, which is where this whole thing started. People, you need to start opening your eyes and realizing this matrix is fixed. It's all designed. And it's not by man alone. And that's why I'm not for it. Now, when we use the Chaldean, December 18, 2009 impeachment, Lo and behold, we get the mighty 96, which is why I have the yin-yang symbol in the background. There it is. That's cancer symbol. And of course, that is the heart chakra. Green, Jupiter. And, um, you know, this is what we're talking about. It's kind of interesting. And of course, Nancy Pelosi, the bozo that she is, part of the whole conspiracy, <laughs> I don't, even, I don't even know if these people are human, but that's besides the point. You know, when you break it down, you know, I broke it down with the full date, spelling it out. Well, now when we do it just using numerals, you get the mirror of the 96, you get the 69. I mean, you got to start asking yourself, what are the odds of these things coming up like this when you start to decode? Because, you know, I mean, they're staring you right in the face. Staring you right in the face. So who do you think runs the government? I tell you, it's not the president. Then when we use the English ordinal, using it with the just the digits, we get the number 131. 131 through the number empire.com, we get the 32nd prime number. Why is that important? Because the element sulfur has an atomic weight of 32. This is its average atomic weight, by the way. And it's the 16th element. Well, that's tied to the tarot. The 16th card in the tarot is the tower card. What just happened today? A lot of that going on. A lot of, this, a lot of people jumping out and going crazy and Zaporuski. A lot of damage today. You know? This can also be tied to the element Xenon, the 54th element. That's for another story. That goes a little bit deeper down the rabbit hole. Just trying to show the easy anomalies here. Now, when we break this down using alchemy, December 18th, 2019, okay, you have eight letters, actually more than that, but you have all these letters here, and we break it down using alchemy, go to our trusty calculator, all these elements added up, yet again, we have another silver match. It equals 107.085, that is a match to silver, ladies and gentlemen. And again, I showed this in the very beginning, 47 is tied to the Tetragrammaton, the yod heh vah -He, the Yahweh, the Yaldabaoth, the New Age name is called Jehovah. They all worship it, and they're all run by it. That's why Washington, D.C. equals 47. That's why White House equals 47. You think these people that run the show, you think that they may know that these things exist? I would think so. I'll bet my ass on it that they do. And they're just playing you like a fool. What do you see? Let's keep going. Here is Pelosi bringing down the hammer. This was this was kind of a, a nice piece to kind of end this. I got a couple more slides, but I mean, you know, we're talking about the element silver again. I mean, this is what December 18, 2019 through alchemy equals 107. Of course, Tetragrammaton, White House, Washington, D.C. But, you know, the word silver, the element itself through numerology is the number 20. And the 20th card in the tarot is the judgment card. What do you think she's doing right here? Bringing down the anvil. Judgment time. I mean, come on, ladies and gentlemen, if you can't see the handwriting on the wall, man, if you can't see this, how this is all connected into our matrix reality, you're one ignorant person. 
I hate to be the person to tell you that, but I mean, this is clear as day how these are, things are all connected, all of them. And last but not least is my last slide. I mean, this is the icing on the cake, ladies and gentlemen. I've shown this before. Donald John Trump, his full name in Chaldean equals 66, just like Richard Michael Pence, his name equals 66, just like the current Pope, Jorge Bellagio, his name equals 66. All of them are all 66. Revelation is the 66th book. This is where the Trump and, Sp Trump and Pence are blown. And But look at this, silver. We're talking about silver, 107, because that's where December... 19th to uh, December 18th 2019 comes from and then of course the masculine side is 107 so when we break that down in numerology we get 163 and the element dysprosium the 66th element has an atomic weight of 163 which matches that up with Donald John Trump so ladies and gentlemen this is not trying to fit a square peg in a round hole this is not trying to st have stretch or trying to reach for things these are legitimate straight up in your face numbers that are connected using the mystical arts and numbers always speak the truth when you line them up when the way they're supposed to be lined up you got to use multiple modalities you cannot just use numerology like some of you want to do it doesn't work that way you must use the elements of the periodic table we're made up of these elements. The, the spells that we speak are made up of these elements. But I'm gonna ask you, what do you see? You wanna get this thing off so you can watch it? It's all I got for today. I mean, I think it's clear as day. This is what runs your White House, folks. Like it or not, that's the way it is. It's the one that runs this matrix reality. It's the one that keeps you stuck as a slave. I'm not, I don't buy into it. I'm not for it. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Not when I found out the information, man. These people are all playing you. They're all part of the big shit show. That's what they're all part of. And they're playing you like a fiddle. I mean, look at this. And like I said, these people, I don't think they're, I mean, I don't know if they're sitting down doing this. I don't know if they're literally doing numerology and alchemy like this, but nonetheless, I can tell you right now that Tetragrammaton, which runs the all-seeing eye, it's right there, man. I mean, it's clear as day. You got the Tetragrammaton, the Israelite, ancient God of Israel, the Tetragrammaton. It's all Hebrew-based, folks. It's in the Old Testament. That's the God of the Old Testament. So if you, you people that like Bible, the Bible stuff, well, that's your God right there. Just so you know, that's what you're bowing down to and praying to. So just so you know, you know, it's clear as day. Well, that's all I got for today. My name is Logan. This is Decode Your Reality. Thanks for watching.